Hey everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. This video will be a guide on how to use Zillow Rental Manager. If you are a landlord or property owner looking to easily list your rentals, screen tenants, and manage payments, then Zillow Rental Manager can help you do just that. It's a very user-friendly tool from Zillow, the same company known for its massive online real estate listings. So Zillow is mostly known for letting people look up houses for sale or rent, but they also offer tools specifically for landlords and property managers. And those include free rental listings as you can post your property on Zillow, Trulia, and Hotpads all at once for free. We also have the tenant screening as we can have potential renters that can apply online, and then you can view their background checks and credit reports. It also offers rent collection as tenants can pay securely online and you will see the money in your bank without chasing checks. We also have the lease builder with a step-by-step -step wizard to create a digital lease e-signable by you and your tenants. And finally, it has maintenance tracking as it can keep track of tasks and repairs from the same dashboard. Essentially, it's like a mini property management software built right into Zello. If you want a quick, straightforward way to handle day-to-day -day tasks, it's worth a look. Real estate is all about convenience and saving time, with Zello's large audience might also bring in more potential renters. So let's get started with setting up our account and the property listing. You want to head over to zello.com and then at the top look for manage rentals and then sign in or create an account. If you already have a Zello account from browsing home listings, you can use that one. If not, click the sign up button and choose your email and password or link it to Google, Apple or Facebook. Agree to the landlord terms as you will see some terms about listing rentals and screening so go ahead and confirm that. And now we get to the point of adding our first property. You want to click on add property as Zello will ask for an address. So type in that address property type. So is it a house? condo or apartment and any unit number. After that, Zello checks if the address is recognized and then once confirmed, the property is in your dashboard. You can then start creating a listing. So if you are ready, you can fill in your property's rent price, number of bedrooms, bathrooms, square footage, lease terms, deposit, and amenities. You can also upload photos or videos if you want to, but if you're not ready to list, you can just save your progress. The listing is free, which is a big plus. However, Zillow does offer optional paid listing boosts or promotional features in some areas if you would like to attract even more prospective tenants. So let's imagine you've just created a listing for a two bedroom unit in Seattle. Next, you might want to accept tenant applications and handle the screening. And that's where Zello's built-in features really shine. To access these screening options, you wanna open your property dashboard. So in your manage rentals page, pick the property and then find the applications tab as this tab or section shows you if anyone has inquired or applied. And then you can send an invite to potential renters via email or copy a direct link to post on social media or share privately. When the renters apply, they fill out an online form requesting details like job information, references, and even the ability to submit background or credit checks through Zello. They will pay a fee typically between the $30 to $35 depending on the region and it also changes over time. And they will do that for a screening. But once it's done, you will get a credit score with a summary with any debts or late payments that the tenants may have. You will also get background check with criminal or eviction records if any and the employment information as the applicant can share references or pay stubs. Now, after an applicant completes everything, you wanna to go to the applications as you will see a summary of each applicant. And then you can also click to see the full report as this includes the credit, background, and references. If you like the applicant, you can move forward. And if not, you can easily decline or ignore the application. Next up, let's talk about the lease builder and the digital signatures. Zello Rental Manager has a lease builder. You simply go to leases in your properties menu, click create lease or Zello lease builder, and then you fill in the terms such as the landlord name, tenants names, address, monthly rent, deposit, disclaimers, and all of that stuff. You can add clauses such as smoking rules, pet policies, renter's insurance requirement, or property specific rules like quiet hours. And then you generate the lease as the system organizes this information into a type document with e-sign placeholders. And then simply you email the link for the lease as tenants receive a link to read and sign digitally. After they sign, you do your electronic signature. And then everything is stored into your Zello account. But if you want to, you can also download a PDF if you prefer a physical copy that you can print out later. This digital approach can save time on scanning, printing, and waiting for in-person signings. 
And then once that's done, you can shift to collecting rent online, which is also built into Zillow's system. You simply go to the payments inside your property listing and find the payments tab. You enter the rent details, whether it's monthly rent amount, due date, security deposit, and any move-in fees. After that, you just connect your bank account by providing your bank information so that the rent is deposited directly into your account. This will require verification steps and connecting your own bank account, but it's pretty straightforward. And then the tenant is supposedly going to log into their own Zillow account to set up their payment method, whether they choose credit card or a direct bank transfer. Now, each transaction might come with a small processing fees if the tenant uses a card, but if they use ACH or bank drafts, it will be cheaper. You just want to check Zillow's updated fee schedule. Another good feature is that Zillow can send automatic reminders a few days before rent is due or email them if they are late. You can specify if you have a grace period or late fees and this can help reduce the hassle of chasing tenants for checks or cash every month. Zillow also provides a maintenance section as you can create tasks, for example, fix the kitchen sink leak and then you can set priority, note approximation, repair cost or schedule tasks for maintenance staff. You can mark the tasks as open, in progress, or closed, and then tenants can email or text pictures of damages which you can store in the listings records. This can be very useful if you manage multiple properties as you can keep all the issues in one dashboard. No more random texts from tenants at 10 p.m. that you'll lose track of. So Zello Rental Manager brings together free property listings, tenant screening, online rent collection, and easy digital leases. If you own or manage just a few units and want a stress-free approach, this can be a great solution. The platform's huge audience means that your listing might get more exposure as well. And with that, we will have reached the end of this video. Thanks so much for watching. Hopefully, you understand now how to create a free listing, manage the tenant applications, build leases, etc. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments down below. We'll be sure to make a new video on them. And if you found this video to be helpful, informative to watch, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.